There was once a 72-year-old woman who was admitted to the hospital after she started claiming that she had two houses because her original house had been cloned, right down to the street that it was on and the furniture that was inside. This woman was suffering from reduplicative paramnesia, which is a neurological disorder that makes people believe that a certain location they're familiar with has been cloned or exists in two places at once. One of the main causes of this disorder can be damage to the right hemisphere of the brain or the frontal lobe. In the case of this lady, it was found that she had a tumor on her right temporal lobe, and once it was removed, her symptoms went away. Other causes can include Alzheimer's and other forms of dementia, psychiatric disorders like psychotic disorders, and even trauma and stress. This is a rare disorder, and we don't fully understand why it occurs, but looking at the areas of the brain involved might give us a clue as to what's going on. The right hemisphere of the brain is involved in a lot of things, including reality orienting, spatial recognition, and familiarity with places. The frontal lobe regulates, among other things, our sense of judgment and our ability to reject false ideas. So some people think that damage to the right hemisphere could disrupt our sense of familiarity and our perception of space, sometimes even making unfamiliar places feel too familiar. And then damage to the frontal lobe stops us from rejecting wrong interpretations of this feeling, like that this place feels too familiar because it's been cloned. If you want to learn more, I've linked some articles in the description.